Hi, Brenda with the Hospice Care Plan. We're going to talk about bladder and the need to urinate during end of life, which changes can change very rapidly. And um, in, a, in our hospice book, we talk about you know what the goal is to normally healthily urinate and to recognize when somebody is unable. And what we know is when somebody is unable to urinate or they're not wanting to wet themselves, which incontinent, which is called incontinence, and is very common at the end of life. That can cause a lot of anxiety and agitation and oftentimes at the end of life towards the end hospice will offer to put a catheter in which can ease care for the provider the person providing care or family and for the, the patient so that it's not a stressor for them um, and as the body slows and declines there can be signs of urinary tract infection which is burning frequency cloud of urine those can also be normal and as long as it's not becoming an issue that does it need to be treated? So, um, but it can be treated. So talk to your hospice about when and if a catheter is needed. Be prepared to address um, incontinence or um, wetting oneself. And there's a QR code in here that you can find how to change a brief and just head, head dressing it head on. So if you have any questions or comments, please ask. You can get a copy of our care plan at the hospicecareplan.com. Thanks.